to my video. It's been quite a while since I've made a video, but today I'm going to do one on what we got our daughter, who is almost seven, for her birthday. I'm going to try and make this video as super quick as I can because I have about 20 minutes before I have to go and pick her up from brownies. So I'm going to be super quick. Um, the first present we got her was the disc set of Beverly Hills Chihuahua. It's literally her favourite movie. When she watches the DVD, she always watches Beverly Hills Chihuahua. Um, and now I can see her actually reading the lines of the actors before they've said it themselves. So I think it's time to introduce her to number two and and three. Another gift we got her is the Creola Creations Catwalk. This is a super battered box, but it was from a charity shop and it was £2.50. But everything inside was all wrapped in the original wrapper. As you can see, all there, all the contents are there. It's so actually the box is going to end up in the bin anyway, but she gets all the fun of the tween side for a quarter of the price of what it would be. I also have bought her this, my first veterinary kit. It comes with an educational book, um, a pet health book, stethoscope, syringes, bandages, test tubes. And I think it's all about doing experiments um, about how to make animals better, perhaps. Um, but this was £15 from Amazon, and I think she's really going to enjoy that. Got her from B&M, a glitter and shine makeup set. It comes with nail polishes, lip gloss, and eyeshadow palette. She loves makeup. Her dad doesn't like her having makeup, but she loves makeup. So just a little bit of makeup for her birthday, I think, will make her really happy. The next thing I got is quite random, but it's actually a pack of newborn nappies. She got a tiny treasures doll for her birthday, and um, nope, for Christmas, and her birthday previous to that. And she's got really into playing with dolls, and she keeps asking, please can I have real nappies for my baby? And actually these were 77p from Lidl's, and much cheaper than what you can actually buy for dolls. This was a, another item that was on sale. It was reduced to it was reduced to seven pounds, and it is the mini brand shop. She actually hasn't had mini brands before. Um, she was with me when I bought it, and she really wanted it, so I said you can have it. But we're going to save it for your birthday. I do need to get some of the mini brands balls to go with it. Otherwise, it's a bit of a pointless present. But I know she's going to like it because she wanted it and she chose it. Also, I had this before Christmas, so you might have actually seen this and some other items in what I got my little girl for Christmas 2022. Um, so some of these items were there, but she'd got so much for Christmas, I wanted to hold some things back and then give it to her, her for her birthday. Um, this is a puppy corn, and it's like a make you feel better vet one. Um, she will absolutely, absolutely love that for sure. I know. Um, I did the mini brands, didn't I? Um, so she saw this Mrs. Llama for £4 in the charity shop yesterday. It is brand new. It's got a label on. It originally came from Asda. She really wanted her, but I said, no, it's your birthday soon. But then snuck back when she wasn't with me and bought her. So she's actually going to be really excited to see that she does have her. Um, a couple of items of stationery here I've got. I've got these pens from Home Bargains. These are smelly gel pens. So they smell cherry, lychee flavour, orange, melon, cucumber, coffee. I think I might quite love the coffee smell one. Um, I think this might be a play on Smiggle, Scribble, maybe. Um, so I think she'll enjoy them. From B&M for £3, I got her a pack of 26 funky stampers. Um, she's never actually had stampers. But I think she'll really enjoy them when she's doing her arts and crafts. Also from B&M, but for a pound, I got some A4 drawing paper for her. From Asda for £5, some pink headphones. She goes to watch her brother at basketball quite a few times a week um, and takes her tablet with her and hasn't got any working headphones at the moment. So this is actually going to be for me because I don't want to listen to what she's listening to whilst I'm cheering on my older son. Um, this was one pound. Oh, they were five pound from Esther. This is an A for Adeline frozen notebook. She loves a notebook. They don't last her long. She takes them to school. All her friends write in them, and then they end up thrown away. So this was one pound seventy. It's just kind of like a stocking birthday filler kind of thing. Um, just a small price gift, but one I know she's going to use and love. 
um, I got this book for her um, from the middle of Little. It is an animal atlas. It was four pounds. Like I said, Adeline loves animals, and this will be really interesting because she'll learn lots of facts on where the animals um, originate from. Um, this is from Asda. This would have been in the what I got her for Christmas haul. It is a friendship letter set. Um, she loves writing notes in notebooks, so now she can write letters to her friends. This I absolutely love. This is by a company, or I think it's a company, Little People Big Dreams. They write books about outstanding people in our world who are either still here or who have passed. Um, the illustrations are absolutely beautiful. This will be her first book of Little People Big Dreams, but definitely not her last. I chose Queen Elizabeth for her because we do love Queen Elizabeth. Um, and we're very sad that she passed away last year. So I think this is this is beautiful for her to have. Yes, it's her first one, but it most definitely won't be her last book from Little People Big Dreams because I will be looking to get some for both my children for their Easter baskets. Okay, these are from B and M. They're kind of like a knockoff Barbie. It's Tiffany's World. It's a pups picnic play set. Um, it was two for twenty, so I also picked up a ice cream one, which I think she's really going to enjoy. Did I show you this? I know I showed you in the what I got my kid for Christmas, but like I said, she had too much stuff. It is just the VTech secret diary. Um, I think this was a couple of pounds from the charity shop. Immaculate, I don't think it's ever been used, but obviously it isn't in its original wrapping. Did I show you Miss Barbie? Also from the charity shop at £6. Do need to do her hair. For Christmas, I said she got a Tiny Treasures doll. Um, and thankfully, they were having a bit of a sale in Argos recently. And I got a couple of outfits for her Tiny Treasures doll. I got this, kind of can't see it very well, but I got this really cute bumblebee one. And obviously a dog one. It's a Dalmatian outfit. And this is a like a blow up chair for the baby to the baby doll to lay in. Um, and it comes with a fairy wand. Um, I think she'll be really happy with that. One thing she did ask for as well is a I'm back is a squishable. I found this today at the charity shop. Is it a fox? Is it a cat? I just don't know. But it was two pounds, so she's got one of those. Um, I am bending, but I am still here. I can assure you. <gasps> the bed is taken up with so much stuff. So, I, um, yes, that squishmallow was £2. Where are you going to buy a squishmallow for £2 from? So, this is a frozen jewellery box. It dances and sings, um, and it will look beautiful in her room with her little bracelets and bits and pieces in. Um, that was a couple of pounds from the charity shop. This was from Home Bargains. It is a light up skipping rope. I think it was £1.70. No more than £2. I really like it. She'll love that. It's a super girly thing. One more rainbow corn. This was in a pack of two. For ten. In the sale in Tesco's. But I separated them. One for her birthday. Uh, coming up. And one previously for Christmas. Let me just check the time on my phone because I cannot be late for brownies. Also, I'm going to move some things. Be right back. I am back. So this is from B&M. It was £7. It is a spinny red thing filled with crayons and pens and markers she is super artistic she loves drawing so she's absolutely going to love that on her desk either in her bedroom i'm not sure if i trust her in her bedroom with marker pens um but or maybe downstairs that might be the safer safer option these bunny slippers super cute these were from the charity shop but they've all been washed and they're beautiful and she loves a bunny, loves animals. And these were £2. And I think I've sized up in them. Well, I didn't really size up. They had a size that were, that the size was one more bigger than she was. But a couple of pairs of socks, she'll be fine. Okay, one more kind of like knockoff squish mellow toy. So this is like her second 
So Doggy Dalmatian, this was on sale for £7, I believe, from Asda. And that was going to be hers for Christmas. But um, again, she had too much, so I saved it. And then I have this big item here. Let me show you. I'm going to have to hold it up. So, oh, this beautiful vanity set comes with, came with actually a mobile phone um, and some wooden fake makeup. This was from a charity shop and it was the grand total of five pounds. I mean, that is a bargain. And now we are on to the two main presents. Let me get the first one out of the box. So the first one was from eBay. Let me unwrap it. It is, you can't actually buy these brand new anymore, but it is the Barbie Puppy um, camper van. And it all opens, um, and it is just a camper van really for puppies. It comes with like a sand tray in there, beds, food. And this was quite expensive on eBay, but it did come with all the original accessories. And I think I paid, maybe I paid too much for it, but I paid 45 pounds for it, including delivery. Is that too much? It's Barbie puppies. And it also came with all the, all the original bits that it came with. Um, when you bought it, when you buy it brand new, um, and the four puppies, so actually I think they're quite expensive on their own. So I'm, I am quite happy, but it is quite a bit of money, especially when you look at what I got her next. And so, the final present, the main present, is oh, it's not the final present. Before I show you that one, let me just show you just something I bought today. It was reduced from £20 to £8 at Asda. Pretty cute. Okay, now onto the main present. And then what is the time? It is 20 past 7. So I've got 5 minutes and I do need to leave. It is... Oh, the... Oh. Well, you can see what it is. This was Lidl's in the middle of Lidl for £50. Even though I bought the puppy camper van first when I saw this I really wanted it for her really wanted it especially this style of one because I know there's been another one there's the new one what came out maybe last year with the giant slide I don't know if this was the one before that but this is the version I did want and I did think gosh that's two campers for her birthday but for 50 pounds oh I couldn't resist. That is just quickly one more present. That isn't here. It is here. I cannot find it. It is a real little medical kit that I got from Home Bargains for like four pounds. Comes with plasters and bandages um, because she has a carrier bag she takes with her with wound spray and plasters in and is ready to help anyone who needs help medically. Um, she walked past a medical box at the place we was at for her brother's basketball. She was most annoyed that they had it because she'd already had it in her bag. And she said, oh, I guess they don't need me then. And off she walked. But anyway, that's everything I got from my soon to be seven year old little girl for her birthday. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking with me. And I'm running now because I've got to get to brownies. Mwah!